What's up guys, back in today with another reaction to Fruits Basket, this time with episode 24. Very excited to get into today's episode as I think we'll be meeting uh, Kyo's master today well, from what we saw at the end of last episode. He actually seems like a really nice guy, so looking forward to seeing what his opinion of Kyo is and um, how they got in the mountains training as well and uh, just what exactly they're actually doing training in the mountains. <laughs> a, lot of, uh, a lot of questions were brought up last episode with Kagura and Kyo, so um, again, very intrigued to see what happens in today's episode. Make sure you let me know what you guys think of this one though down in the comment section. Leave a like on the video if you guys did like the video and subscribe to the channel if you you want to keep up to date with these daily reactions let's get right into the episode guys three two one let's go yeah i think we're getting quite a bit of a focus on kyo today oh my god so his mum killed herself That is Master. Kazuma Soma. A very relaxing voice. I recognise it as well. Looks like this, looks like this might have been the type of guy maybe Yuki needed. And he was younger, maybe. Damn. I'll start him right off with that. <laughs> so, unfortunately, Kyo's mum killed herself. Potentially because of something to do with Kyo. Maybe it's because he was the cat spirit. Interesting. But yeah, it seems like that got, that's quite a soothing, quite a soothing master he's got there. Seems like it would have been handy for, again, Yuki to have when he was younger, maybe. Kisa as well. A lot of the characters. <laughs> like he seems like one of the good kind of parent figures from the Soma family. One of very few, <laughs> from what we've seen so far anyway. Susume. I wonder if we'll have a little bit of a focus on Kagura today as well. She did bring up some history of Kyo, but maybe they're going to save that for another time. As that's another character, like another good look at as well. As much as she goes off the rails sometimes, I do like Kagura. Ah, so he's a, almost a teacher to all of them. A little bit. Co more than the others. Has he now? What is the what is this I'm still wondering about this bracelet again, it's just nothing Co would usually wear, is it? Doesn't just it doesn't seem like him. And when I say that, I mean, it doesn't seem like something he'd stylistically wear out of kind of fun, for example. He wouldn't wear it because it makes him look nice. Because again, it doesn't really suit him. I'm also kind of wondering a little bit about this shot from last episode where the hat fell off the bed. It's quite odd to show that. So I'm wondering why they did. Is 
Is he happy to see him? I guess is this their normal greeting? <laughs> there he is. Nice. Damn. I haven't really seen him smile like that for, a, for much. Huh. Interesting. What happened to Ko's father then? And a bit too soft, is he? He's a bit afraid. Oh god, that can only be trouble. Wow, what a mess. You do hear the most creative people are very messy like that though, aren't they? <laughs> Get a few rounds, eh? Remove it. What is this it? <clears throat> What are they talking about? I think Kagura understands, probably doesn't she? She's part of the family. I can't imagine this is anything bad. Must be for Kyo's good. I bet everything on Honda. Maybe that's why Kagura stayed a little quiet there and looked a little glum. Maybe this is the kind of, not marriage, but a relationship kind of thing or something. Again, I don't really have any, much idea, but...
a scene that way. It was already over. Who's he shouting at? Everyone's in a pretty rotten mood right now, it looks like. What is this? What is the... Already over? It took the bracelet off. Is the bracelet doing something then? Oh shit, is he a big cat? I can't imagine Honda's not gonna accept this if you know what I'm saying. She's a very accepting person. Is he a big cat? Misshapen. Oh my god. Fucking hell. It doesn't actually look that gross. It looks a bit like a dragon. Fuck off. I hate that guy. That must have been some kind of restriction on his transformation or something. Fucking hell. Damn, I really can't imagine her being disgusted by that. Although, she looks shocked as fuck. As you would be. No, you have no comprehension of what that is, but look at her. She's running towards it. She doesn't even really know what it is. if she did find it disgusting she'd run the other way right so what happened to make him go like this seems like that guy's grandfather went through the same thing as well with this kind of strange transformation again it almost seems like a bit of a dragon it looks like a bit like a dragon mixed with a cat
That makes sense why she didn't want anyone to see him. God damn, he's powerful. He stinks as well. Oh, fuck. I was about to say, I really hope he doesn't lash out when she's right next to her. God. Gonna call right back up there, isn't she? Oh. That she is just gonna go. Guess he did push her right to the edge, didn't he? Okay, hell, man. I, I do have a feeling she was a very loving mother. So she's got to crawl back. I, I agree. Yep. I love those scenes, as easy and simple as they were. Just him listening to her just does a lot, doesn't it?
Talk about his mum. You got that now, bro. Oh god. Oh my god. Let's go, Q. Ah, I didn't go for the kiss. <laughs> oh sure he's going for the kiss then. And a little bit lighter. Fucking hell, man. That backstory is great. Yeah, no, I don't think it's fully fleshed out. Yeah. I think we've still got a bit more to go, but. Wow. Corey's accepted this ugly side of him that even his mother had to overlook. And she seemed like a lovely person to an extent. <laughs> oh man, look at that little cat. Dear thoughts for anything I think they've just got maybe even 10 times closer after this and it looks like this plan kind of worked the Kagura knew about this as well of course I think Fucking hell, man. Summer will be here soon. What an episode. <laughs> what an episode. Uh, I think a couple of you guys did tell me it was going to be a great episode today, but wow. Uh, I think that might have been probably best... Yeah, maybe probably the best episode of the season so far. Wow. Again, that was uh, that was really well done. As usual with the backstories, <clears throat> they usually play into a lot of what we see about the character. And Kyo is a character we've seen more than most... Um, well, of course he's one of the main characters but in in terms of seeing him as his actual current self and uh, seeing him not seeing his backstory was what i'm trying to say not seeing the parts that made him who he is now but um seeing the person that he, almost the completed person he's not completed of course but uh, the person that he is in this current moment and seeing all this backstory leading into this and seeing all the seeing what he's hidden up until this point uh from what we said last episode uh kagura brought up a couple of things he was hiding and of course we get to see that now and uh it's just again just absolutely crazy how much of an effect this had on uh both him and his family and I imagine what his probably grandfather had to deal with as well um luckily enough his grandfather i think being called grandfather means that he did grow old so um he didn't have to die young or anything there's there's, there's still a bit of mysteries in there for me regarding that um to what exactly is this kind of curse of the cat and such and why he can't get at the table still um, and what this whole dark magic I don't think they said dark magic but what this kind of bad magic that caused this is um, again still plenty of uh, plenty of questions on my end but uh, this answered a whole lot of questions today and was again just absolutely awesome and uh, very very emotional um, especially with his mother dying and such seeing her kind of overlook a part of him uh, she absolutely loved him but she didn't love all of him so um that obviously creates a little bit of hesitation is hid in, in his mind as to whether she did actually truly love the real him so um yeah some big questions and of course tori loves all of him um, in that manner so it's just absolutely lovely seeing those kind of both his mum and tori kind of compared in that manner and uh tori again being the absolutely lovely girl that she has come to accept him for um his stinky horrible form I don't even think it looks that bad, but I do, I do kind of wonder what it smells like. Um, but yeah, honestly, I don't even think it looks that bad. But Toru is, again, just the person that would accept that, isn't she? Um, but yeah, again, just some very, very touching moments today. Um, awesome master as well. Looks like uh, that is actually going to benefit 
Kyo is he's probably going to be a whole lot more of accepting of, of himself now. Um, I mean, you're going to question your acceptance of yourself if your own mother doesn't really uh, truly love the true you, aren't you? You're going to be like, well, do, would anyone? Do, should I even accept myself at this point? Um, so again, it's just absolutely a lovely job that Honda's doing with the whole family um, and again looking forward to seeing some of the master's thoughts maybe next episode and seeing some of the other characters thoughts as well Kagura is a character I'll be interested to see um, what her thoughts are on this situation she did seem to know from what we saw last episode as well um, but yeah awesome episode make sure you let me know guys think about this one down in the comment section probably my favorite episode yet uh, leave a like on the video if you guys do like the video and subscribe to the channel if you do want to keep up to date with these daily reactions I will be back tomorrow with episode 25 the last episode of the season so hopefully uh, well, hopefully you guys enjoy me for that one and enjoy the rest of your day guys